and we are tracking dangerous heat today. Yeah, it could be one of the hottest days of the work week and the heat index today expected to reach 105. This weekend temps could even rise higher. IMSA reminding you to stay hydrated, wear light or loose fitting clothes, and if you do show any signs of a heat stroke, call 911 immediately. And a large swath of the state still impacted from this weekend severe weather. Parts of Tulsa were hit particularly hard. Tulsa County alone just dealing with more than 120,000 customers without power. Crews working right now to get the lights back on there in Tulsa and also statewide. Happening now, the state has enacted emergency waivers to help with storm recovery. Governor Stitt says the Oklahoma Department of Emergency Management will continue to survey damage to buildings, infrastructure and utilities. Also developing this morning, one man is dead after a rollover crash and what police say is an alleged street racing incident. So this happened last night on the south side of Lake Overholzer. The driver of one car died at the scene. Another person was also injured. An official cause of the crash is still being investigated, but they believe alcohol may have played a factor. Starting today, ODOT wants to hear from you as they put together their new coordinated transportation plan. It's all in an effort to identify transportation needs of Oklahomans with disabilities, seniors, and low-income communities. They also want to talk strategies for meeting the needs. So today's meeting for the Northeast region, it starts at 1 p.m. through Zoom. We posted a link in the As Seen On section of our app. And let's go ahead and get you outside as we prepare for that extreme heat today. Johnson Controls camera giving us this view of Norman and more areas. Hope all of you are waking up well, but you are going to need, again, to stay hydrated. Find yourself a cool spot. Temperature right now, 75 degrees. Feels like 75. Last weather on the five, so let's go ahead and get over to Sabrina. 655 here. Yeah, it is a warm start to our day and only going to get hotter. Heat alerts for today for this dangerous heat. Heat advisories for the Oklahoma City Metro, also near Tulsa. All of these orange counties is where we are expecting it to feel around 105 this afternoon and evening. Even hotter southern Oklahoma. That's where the excessive heat warning is. That is where it is going to feel like 110 to 115. That is from Lawton over to Ardmore. It is going to be very, very hot, feeling humid outside. Already feeling humid and warm this morning. 74 in Oklahoma City, 75 for those of you in Norman and sitting at 77 in Bethany. There is a bit of a breeze around 10 to 15 miles an hour and that even small breeze will try to help it feel somewhat better outside at least this morning and into the afternoon, but can't get away from the heat. Still going to be climbing into the low 90s for today. It's just that humidity. It's going to surge north. It is going to be feeling uh, so much hotter feeling again over 100 low chance of storms tomorrow night on your Wednesday that is mainly far western Oklahoma also watching for those storms Thursday and Friday and then into the weekend it is going to be hot back into the mid 90s.